Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, how are you doing today? My name is MC Kasmi and of course allow me to take you around at the fourth graduation ceremony of Victoria University. Now last year we were at Kabira Country Club but this year uh, because the audience have grown bigger, because the number of students and graduates have grown bigger, we have decided to take it to Speak Resort Munyonyo and that is where we are right about now. And now something interesting about this graduation is that uh, it's going to be like in three phases. One, we shall have the conferring session where we shall have some speeches and of course conferring of diplomas and uh, degrees and later on what you see right here is the more like a meet and greet you know uh, for the party for the graduates and later on we shall also have lunch man it's just amazing ladies and gentlemen welcome aboard one more time fourth graduation ceremony we're going to be talking to the graduates and find out how they feel and of course i'm looking forward to see who is the overall best student right here at the fourth graduation ceremony 2019 welcome aboard Put the bounce board for the one time Bouncing they feel like I'm your shit I am not one of your friends or your homies, little baby I put them slower than Cody Already know, she already know I go crazy You cannot cry on my shoulder Yes, Dr. Shama, how are you doing? I'm doing well, how are you doing? Uh, I'm doing quite fine. Uh, I should say congrats, I mean, it's been an impressive uh, function today. Thank you, Kashmir. Yeah, so tell me about the entire, you know, the theme of the graduation was uh, uh, developing... Agents of change. Agents of change. Tell yes. me about it. Well, we, we realize that uh, we all need to be agents of change. No. We, we, we can't be the change or we may not be the change, but being agent of change, it, yeah. it takes you, it, it keeps you relevant the whole life because even in your 80s, you will still be exactly. agents of change. All right. Um, we're still here, fourth graduation ceremony and uh, former guild president, VU, how are you doing? I'm great. How are you? The girl with three names, are they now four or three? three yeah. Maria Peggy Nabunya. All right, I've been privileged to meet the best overall student here at Victoria University. Uh, nice to meet you, Shana. Nice to meet you too. Congrats, I should say. Yeah, thank you so much. Are you like extremely excited? I mean, you've been the overall best student, you know? Well, those were three. Sure. Overall female, best female, then overall in my faculty, and then overall in the university. So, so that, that means you received over three plaques. Mm -hmm. right? I mean, what's <laughs> been that one thing that you've been, you know, riding on for making sure that it's been a successful year? Actually, we are, uh, all we are doing is to uh, trying to create holistic graduates. Yeah. Just like we train them very well, we gave them three internships, mm. uh, we gave them a lot of practicals, uh, exposure and at the end we also did a uh, one week program called Towards Total Graduate yeah, yeah. where we taught them everything and even how to write an application, how to make CV, how to look for a job, how to appear in the job wow. once you get the job, how do you manage your work life. For example, nowadays we don't talk about work life balance, yeah. we talk about work life integration. Yeah. How do you do that? Then you'll go into relationship, how to handle relationships, yeah. how to handle your spirituality. So we, we move towards Total Graduate. So when, wherever they are, they are always relevant. Congrats. Thank you. Every time I come to VU, I always want to miss an interview with her, but there is always something forcing me. Today I was like, okay, she's just graduated. Maybe perhaps I have had so many interviews yeah. with you, I shouldn't have one. And yeah. then you're among the best. I was like, oh my God, I have no choice, but I have to interview her again. You know? <laughs> oh my God, I didn't expect it, you know. Yeah, yeah. I didn't. I knew I was the best in my class, but not in the whole faculty. So when they read my name, I was like, oh my God. I was so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> Truly. Wow, amazing, amazing, amazing. So tell me about uh, your experience at campus, you know. What has been your, uh, your, your, your secret to success, I mean, becoming the overall best student at VQ? Uh, one, actually, the, the most is that you've got to be friendly. Yeah. Respect people actually, yeah. right from the, from the security, the office assistant, yeah. up to the VC. And, you know, getting along, like, you know, it, we call it survival techniques. <laughs> uh, another brother of mine I'm meeting here at the fourth graduation ceremony. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Okay. Yeah. Uh, how do you feel, I mean? Congrats, first of all. Well, uh, I would thank Victoria University about the, the event organized for us. Yeah, yeah. Actually, it was a high, uh, high quality yeah. event you have participated. One, yeah. Well, uh, everything was really uh, perfect, and I really loved the ceremony, actually. How are you doing? I'm fine. I've literally had interviews for a long time and this might be your last interview by the way. Yeah. <laughs> Say hi to the people. 
Hi everyone, I'm so happy to have graduated from Victoria University. It has been three years yeah. and very exciting years. So I thank God and I thank everyone. I'm really excited about this day. Yeah, very excited. I woke up literally at 4 a.m. Really? And how, oh, come on, are you saying that you know me waking up at 4 a.m. like before, you know? No, I normally wake up at 5, but today was exceptional. I had to wake up at 4. Uh, the last conversation we had last year around this time, uh, your priorities when it comes to the university, Victoria University, were research. Are you impressed with the results so far? Yeah, I think we've published about 20 articles so far through the faculties, to the, through the students. I saw today uh, one, one uh, lecturer published six articles in a year and a half. Um, and we've had about three, four students' uh, work getting published. So we're on the right track for exactly what we're out, sought out to target, to build more credibility in the university through its research. And I've seen the numbers have really increased. Well done. Thank you very much. Yeah, because uh, we're at Kabira, and I feel, I feel like Kabira wouldn't be enough for such an audience we had today. No, no. We were, today we graduated about 70 students um, in total. And, uh, of course, uh, all the family members, friends wanted to come along, yeah, support yeah. them. It's a big day for all the graduates. Yeah. It's a day they, they start a big journey in their lives. Um, so it's important. Uh, we thought we'd do something different, something bigger, something better and grow the event, our graduation even uh, larger. You have over like three envelopes, you take a trip at least for like yeah. a should, where, where should I go, Dubai? Where do you want me to go? How was your performance and which course have you been pursuing? But, uh, actually, I was performing a Bachelor of Procurement and Logistics at yeah. Victoria University. Well, I think my performance was very, very great. Yeah, yeah. I think I got the first class, I think, but I didn't get my transcript. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But uh, I really loved the collaboration with the lecturers, mm. with the, the dean. They were really, really cooperative. So tell me, what, what's been your, your secret to success? I mean, being the best student in your class. Do you know, the truth is, um, when I started in Victoria University, I promised myself that I would have a first class every semester. Awesome. And I was dedicating my degree to my mom. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, if I'm dedicating it to my mom, it better be good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is she around, by the way? Yeah, she is. And, and yeah. It, she needs to say hi to us, but let's come through, come through and say hello. I mean... <laughs> Uh, you know, every time we've been having a conversation with you, every time I had a conversation with her, she was talking about you. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Uh, are you happy about her performance? Oh, of course, God is great. It's been a long journey with yeah. a lot of challenges, but we are there. We've made it. Amazing, amazing. What's yes. the name, by the way? Mary Gloria. Mary. Yes. Oh, that's why you. Mary you and Maria. Oh, I see. I see. I see the holy. I see the holy connection. Yeah. You have in stock for her, she just became the, uh, she was the overall best student in her class, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. She has to continue with the vigor, with the vibe and uh, with a lot of uh, confidence. And the sky is a limit for her. We pray for her, we are very proud of her. Are you throwing a mega party after here? Because me, I'm already <laughs> dressed enough for it. Oh yeah, you're welcome. On Sunday we'll be having a, gra a graduation lunch. It will be in Logogo, so you are invited to join us. And if you don't call me, Mama just said yes. Okay, let, let me speak to her as we finalize. Okay, now uh, I need to know one thing, yeah? Uh, are you planning to go for Masters now you're down here, I mean? Yes, I do plan on going for Masters. I yeah. don't think I'll go immediately. I was planning to go immediately, but now that I look into it, I don't think I'll go immediately. Okay, I'll need so some work. What are you planning to concentrate on? Um, I'm planning on concentrating on the different things that I've started while in campus. Yeah, yeah. So I want to continue with those, you know, focus on those, see them excel, and then maybe move forward to masters. Tell me about your results. I mean, how do you um, I did well. I got four point. I don't remember four point. I missed a. Fi uh, fi uh, a first class, but no, I missed it by like point something. I got 4.42 or something. I think you relaxed a little bit because I feel like, you know. No, there are things that they made me do like financial accounting and things like that that yeah, yeah. brought it down. Yeah. yeah. Showing improve. I'm not an average dude. Honestly, though, promises broke. Probably would make me savage. Probably would get me the magic. I'm counting carrots and cabbage. Came so far just to break my heart. All right. So tell me, I mean, you're done with campus. Uh, are you? Are you have plans of you know proceeding with more masters or you know something else, uh, school-wise or something? Uh, yes. Actually, I just did a diploma.